Hello, I will try and help explain how you install and run the Starbo Arrows ladder client to help you ladder in Starbo. What you do is you go to starbomod.com and you hit the register button if you haven't registered a profile. You will be able to register by using your main email address. Uh, once you're done with that, you will be sent to a window where you can download the Arrows ladder client for either Windows or Mac. If you have a Windows computer like I have, uh, and after you unzip the file that you downloaded, it should look something like this. If you have a Mac, it looks very similar, but you don't have this file. Don't worry about that. Try to open arrows.exe. If that doesn't work, run this program. And uh, this is a free program made from Microsoft just to run C++ applications. And it's not gonna, it's not gonna get you any other stuff like a Bing bar or anything. Don't worry about that. It's just, yeah, it's just fine. So you open arrows.exe and the first time you open it, you go straight into the options menu. That looks something like this. You should also uh, have this um, background window, which is the where you downloaded the arrows client um, from in the starbo.mod uh, website. You're gonna need that. So you should get that up as well. Once you are in the starbo arrows client, like you see alpha version three arrows, you uh, click the new profile and you write out your profile name to be exactly the same name you chose for your nickname in starbomod.com. That's important. And once you're done with that, you find your authentication token in Starbomod and you copy that out and you set authentication token in the arrows client and you paste that in there and make sure it's exactly the same. Once that is done, you can uh, do some other settings. Search range can either be narrow, normal or wide. That depends how much difference you want between you and your opponents. Start Star won't log in. It's just uh, when you open Windows if you want to start the Eros client right away. Uh, things like that. Uh, this uh, StarCraft 2 user folder should be set uh, to something like this by default. If your Eros keeps crashing, um, you, can ch you should change this. Uh, and there are instructions on the website on how you can do that. I'm not going to go through that right now because it's a little bit tricky. Uh, once that is done, you click the Manage Battle.net Accounts because you need to link your user to your Battle.net account. And you can click that, but then you're going to quickly need to go to your web browser and go to Battle.net uh, like this. And log into Battle.net, click StarCraft 2, and then hit Profile here. Uh, you can add one profile for every region. Like, so I'm in, I'm in EU.Battle.net now. If I want to add my um, US profile or NA profile, um, I, I type EU in front here instead. Uh, and I can do that as long as I've logged into EU at least once uh, in, the, in the actual game by using the global play setting. But you hit the profile here and you're gonna get, gonna get this URL, which is very important. You copy that out. And then I click the Manage Battle.net accounts. I click Add Battle.net profile. That button needs to be a little bit bigger. And then you paste that URL there. And you're not going to have these things on the left that I have now. Once you have done that, the client will ask you to change profile picture. You do that by going into StarCraft 2, the game itself. You log into the proper region, and in this case, the EU region. And you change the profile picture to the one that is here. You just After that, you wait for a couple of seconds and you hit the update button. It should then say that your profile has been verified. This is a little bit... Um, this depends a little bit on how many times we have people have done that during a day we're only allowed to do it x amount of times for one day i think so this might take some time but it's it's been mostly uh, unproblematic if you want one for na or any other server as well, well currently there's only laddering on eu and na uh, you add battle.net profile again and then you find your other link for na or uh, us.battle.net se2 and then you hit go in and hit profile again and you get another link that you go in there and you need to verify that one with changing your profile picture as well. Remember, you can always change your profile picture back again after your account has been verified. So we don't force you to use a certain profile picture. Once that is done, you can hit matchmaking and you can start uh, pressing the Q button and you can start to ladder. Remember that when you cross out the arrows ladder client, it doesn't actually close completely. It goes to the system tray, kind of like your um, Skype does or, or uTorrent or something like that. So make sure if you want to close the Eros client completely, you, you left click down in the system tray and you click close and then it closes completely. Be very careful, do not queue 
and then just close and think that you're not going to find an appointment because you will so you need to unqueue before you close uh, or you have to close it down in the system tray so remember that and happy starboing <laughs>